What do you think of Rob as a director? It's cool to work with Rob as a director. It's nice to be able to watch how he will he unfolds with his dramatic long form debut because I know him as a video director. Um, when I had my band back in the 90s, he would be at the clubs and we would sometimes see him with a video camera and he'd offer to shoot videos for us. And then he shot a lot of videos for a lot of people. Uh, he shot a, a video for my sister's boyfriend's band and she styled it. So we have that relationship. It's a different thing when you're suddenly dealing with actors and you have to remember that it's not just the look of what's inside the frame and the energy and the editing and the post, but that there are people on the other side of that lens that are counting on you to give guidance and to say, what did you really mean by this? What was your interpretation? And he's doing a nice job of that. He kind of gently nudges us towards, towards the objective. Did you expect him to have that style of directing? Um, I wasn't really sure what to expect with Rob as a, as a, as a dramatic director. You know, I, it's hard to say. I mean, people can be one way before you get to set and then two or three days into it, they can transform radically. He seems to be the same Rob I know from before, which is nice. How much of the interaction between you and the other characters, like for instance, Lloyd, who plays your best friend, Adam Sinclair? I understood coming into this project that the its, um, its effectiveness is going to come from the relationships between these characters. One of the funnest things about train spotting was the dynamic between the four lead guys. And, and though they were all completely different from each other, you really felt that there was this dyed in the wool kind of bond between them and that they were what they were. And, and watching that dynamic. It's just like any Guy Ritchie film, it's really about every character in the film that matters. And so we had to kind of jump in head first and make sure that immediately we were starting to connect outside of the actual shooting process because there's only so much you can do with a cold start. So Billy and Adam and I have done very well getting along with each other. Although they speak in a weird Scottish accent, I can barely understand them, but other than that, it's been really great.